Exciting updates regarding stimulus checks and new direct deposits are detailed in today's video. The sums of $2,000 and $2,200 can be arriving in your bank account without any intermediaries. Who can receive these payments and when will they be available? We'll explain everything. In addition, we will provide you with an easy-to-follow blueprint for obtaining these monies. Whether you're having trouble or are simply seeking further assistance, this update has the potential to make a significant impact. Eligible Alaskans can now receive a stimulus payment of $1,312 according to the state's Department of Revenue. The Alaska Permanent Fund Corporation, which runs a system akin to a savings account, is in charge of this endeavor. To aid locals financially, it disperses monies annually. The goal of this yearly donation is to help the local economy and alleviate financial hardship. Helping people manage their finances and bolstering regional economic stability are both goals of the program. A large number of Alaskans will get a stimulus check, totaling $1,312 to help with their financial requirements. This initiative highlights the dedication of the state to supporting its citizens in bolstering Alaska's economic stability. Be on the lookout for this helpful payout in your account if you qualify. When inflation is strong in Alaska, the permanent fund dividend PFD becomes even more important as a source of financial aid. Akin to a universal basic income, the Permanent Fund of Alaska PFDFD is administered by the Alaska Permanent Fund Corporation and offers a constant flow of funding to inhabitants. Payments from the PFD provide consistent, long-term aid in contrast to the often limited and transitory government stimulus payouts. There will be less strain on household finances and more stability in the face of increasing living expenses thanks to this ongoing assistance. It is possible that processing and distribution of these funds would be delayed due to the high volume of applications anticipated this year. The PFD team is making every effort to get the money to the right people as soon as possible. As they go through this, we ask that you please be patient and understanding. You may have heard the huge news that those in need are now receiving direct installments of $2,000 and $2,200 if you're watching. Many people are counting on this update since it alleviates their financial burdens. Learn all about these unexpected stimulus payments in this video. We'll go over everything you need to know to apply, including the requirements, the potential effects of these payments, and how to avoid problems with your check. Come on, we can begin. The stimulus checks, which come with a $2,000 and $2,200 value, are a component of a new program that aims to provide financial assistance in times of need. The recipients of these funds will be families and individuals who are experiencing financial hardship and are therefore unable to meet basic needs. Because many people are still struggling financially, the government has chosen to hand out these checks so that those in dire need might get some aid right away. The purpose of these stimulus checks is to alleviate some of the urgent demands, which will help with the rising cost of living and give some financial security in these unpredictable times. There are strict or prerequisites for receiving the $2,000 stimulus check, such as a certain salary level and length of time in the country. The goal of these requirements is to direct the funds to individuals who really need them. In order to help you decide if you are eligible for this amount, we will explain the qualifying requirements in full. Those with more pressing financial needs are usually the ones who meet the slightly different requirements for the $2,200 check. People in this category may have lower earnings or be experiencing more severe financial difficulties. If you want to get the right amount, you need to know these prerequisites. Submit an application if you. I think you qualify for a stimulus check. Depending on your circumstances, the application procedure may differ. However, it usually entails providing the required paperwork and details. Such documents may provide evidence of residents' income and other pertinent financial information. Here you can find comprehensive instructions on how to fill out the application and a list of the necessary documents. Make sure your application is being handled by following up after you've submitted it. We'll walk you through the steps to see where your application stands and what to do if anything goes wrong. Getting one of these stimulus checks can be a huge relief financially, allowing you to pay for things like rent, utilities, and groceries. You will learn how these monies can improve your day-to-day -day life and receive instant support through the payments. These payments can help you in the short term, but they can also have long-term benefits like preventing debt and saving money. But there can be problems like processing delays or problems with eligibility verification. In the event that these problems materialize, we will discuss them and provide advice on how to solve them. In order to shed light on this topic, we have collected some frequently asked questions regarding these stimulus checks. To help you understand the process, we will cover frequently asked questions such as how to check your payment status and how to address any concerns with getting your check. We will give you advice on how to fix problems and who to talk to if you run into delays or inconsistencies. 
If you require more assistance, we can point you in the direction of relevant government agencies, community groups, and financial planners. Eligibility application procedures and possible effects of the $2,000 and $2,200 stimulus checks have been discussed in detail. Be sure to stay informed and follow the processes to get your check because these payments are meant to help out when things get rough. If you enjoyed this and would like to receive more updates on financial support and other vital news, subscribe to our channel. If something is unclear or if you need further help, just post a remark. In order to better understand today's topic, let's take a look at the distribution procedure of these stimulus checks and what you may anticipate from them. You can better prepare yourself by familiarizing yourself with the distribution schedule and processes. You should expect to have the stimulus checks for $2,000 and $2,000, $2,200 sent to your bank account by electronic transfer because the distribution is being handled through direct deposits. In most cases, this is a safer and quicker alternative than mailing actual checks. You probably already have everything in place to get these monies deposited into your account if that's how you've always gotten your government payments. Make sure your banking information is current if it has changed or if you haven't set up direct deposit before. Make sure the appropriate government agency has your accurate bank account information before they send you your money. Because incorrect or incomplete banking information could cause cash to be delayed or not sent at all, this verification step is vital. You should also keep an eye on any official announcements about the payment schedule and check your bank account for the deposit on a regular basis. It is possible to fix problems with your stimulus check, such as an erroneous amount or a delay, by following certain procedures. To begin, go to the official government website or the application platform to see where your payment stands. To keep you apprised of your payment's progress and any developments, several government agencies offer online tools. Get in touch with the proper authority immediately if you notice an issue. They will be able to explain things more clearly and show you how to fix the problem. Being cognizant of how these payments can affect your whole financial status is also helpful. The purpose of the stimulus checks is to alleviate financial hardship immediately, but they can also help with long-term goals like saving for retirement. You may put the money towards paying off debt, saving for an emergency, or buying things you need. Better financial stability and readiness to face future problems can be yours with careful management of these assets. The larger economic backdrop must be considered with the short-term monetary respite offered by these payments. Individuals and families are being helped during these economically challenging times through stimulus payments which are a component of a bigger program. The function of these payments in aiding economic recovery and stability can be better understood by learning about their purpose and impact. It is also important to stay updated on any program-related modifications or updates if you are eligible for these checks. Keeping yourself informed will allow you to make the most of the available support, as government programs are occasionally subject to revisions or extra conditions. Get up to date on any changes that can influence your eligibility or the distribution of funds. By regularly checking official sources for news and updates. Finally, the stimulus checks of $2,000 and $2,200 provide a great chance for financial help and support in these tough times. You can make sure you receive your money without any problems by learning the eligibility conditions, application process, and distribution methods. From the specifics of the payments to helpful hints for handling and fixing problems, we've covered a lot in this video. If you like this video and would like to continue receiving updates on financial news and aid programs, you can subscribe to our channel. If you think that someone you know might find this video helpful, please feel free to share it with them. We are able to keep providing helpful content and updates because of your support.